specialty shops and stores are hard to come by. People with a certain set of skills who specialize in a specific field are hard to find. Lucky for us, today, social media helps. So when we find a specialty shop that serves us just with exactly what we need, it would help a lot of people to prop them up. Here's our Greg's work story. A car and moto suspension specialty repair shop in Arayat, Pampanga. When I decided to finally get a motorcycle for myself in 2022, just when COVID restrictions were being lifted, I finally got permission from wifey to commute to work on a motorcycle. Most peeps would get, I guess, a new Honda Click because why not? It's the top-selling scooter Honda has. But not me. I'm Mr. Maarte. I've got my eyes on the Honda Zoomer X for a long time now. I just didn't have the balls to convince my wife into riding motorcycles. Ayo naman niya kung motor for the past 15 years since my scooter samplangs back in our binata days. How I got her to agree? Well, that's a story for another day. So I got version 1 of the Honda Zoomer X from the Facebook Marketplace. Yep, second hand lang kinuha natin. After all, matagal nang ni-release itong mga Zoomer Xs. The black and orange one. But syempre, si Boy Maarte, that is me, got the modified Zoomer on a rare fatty wheel and extended 4-inch swing arm. Having this setup, of course, beg for a stance ride setup as well. Medyo low rider, drop drop stance. So I got the zoomer on a near busted YSS rear shock, which would leak after a few long rides. Sarap sa expressway ano? Oh. <laughs> and a soft, worn out front suspension. I just winged the thing around with the zoomer with what was on it. Didn't bother to ask if the ride could get any better. But boy, was it matagtag. I thought it was the price to pay for a low stance. Low and slow is life. Fast forward to two happy years on the bike. Wiki, my eldest son, has now turned 18. And I promise to give him a ride when he's fit for the road and got a license. So, the zoomer is now his. But just before I handed him the reins, a bunch of wear and tear issues were needed to be sorted out. Diyan naman magaling at mahilig si Wiki, sorting out mechanical and tech stuff. Kaya, I decided to get the Zoomer din as a project for both of us to work on. Something low and slow we could both enjoy. Iset up niya, i-ride ko. <laughs> Joke lang, Wiki. So, he fixed the fuel pump issue, water in the tank issue, throttle delay issue, kung ano-ano pang issue. Dami issue ng Zoomer. Kapalit ng aking wallet budget issue. Siyempre, mag-finance lahat doon. But, no problem. Kahit na magastos, okay lang. We were enjoying setting up the Zoomer. Ipon lang pag may budget na, tsaka gagawin. No hurry. Banding eh. For the suspension, the Zoomer was then running on a busted 285mm Mutaru Rare Shock as a replacement for the busted 300mm YSS shop. Puro busted, ano? Low and slow pa more. He was desperate to find a fix kasi buying a new one with the specs he wanted was so costly. Sobrang mahal. Like, mga 4,000 plus pataas costly. So, scouring through the Facebook posts, he chanced upon a shop in Arayat, Pampanga who repairs shocks Mostly YSS. So he thought, pa, what if pagawa na lang natin YSS shock natin sa Arayat? May FB page pala sila oh. Gumagawa ng YSS, RCB, pati coilovers nga ng kotse. Well ako naman, nasa isip ko lang, buti na lang di ko tinapon yung YSS nung nasira siya at nag Pwede pa palang gawin yun. So we went off to Arayat to get acquainted with Greds Works Pampanga. Arriving at the location, Greds Works is a home-based suspension service shop owned and operated by Sir Sigrid, 
Hence the name, Grids Works. Parang gredy, no? Hehe. <laughs> Pero legit na repair shop ito. When we got there, super busy siya. Coordinating transport of repaired shocks. Mostly, mga padala na shocks for repair from other provinces and locations within Pampanga. Buti na lang may ganito na sa Pampanga that you can run to kesa sa lumawas pa ng Maynila to get your suspension repaired and tuned. So after exchange of pleasantries, na-diagnose na agad ni Sir Gret yung diferensya ng front shock ni Mickey. Too much preload. Ubus na travel ng shock pag umaanda. Kaya matagtag. Kumbaga, mahina na yung spring. Kaya pala, kahit hindi kami nakalowered sa front stanchions, eh parang stance na agad yung ride. Ubus na agad yung travel. So here's Kred's Works Pampanga to the rescue. So, uh, I'm si Gred Paul Idus Maliwat. So, may pangalan ng shop natin mga boss is... Uh... Great Sports Pampanga. So, located tayo mga boss sa puro puro telapayong right Pampanga. So, pwede siyang ipin sa Google Map na Great Sports Pampanga V2. So, naging V2 siya kasi mga boss sa uh, nangyari. Nasira kasi yung unang page natin. So, hinahanap ng mga nagpapagawa sa atin. Kaya gumawa ko ng bago. Kaya ginawa ko V2. Kasi yung dating Google Map, uh, Great Sports lang. So, hindi na mahanap. Kaya nalagyan ko ng V2 para mag-bus na naman. Gano'n na katagal yung shop? So, nag-start ako boss na 2017. Ayan. So, dati kasi boss, 20, year 2017, nung nag-start ako boss sa mga... Uh, nakahilig ako kasi yung motor, eh, yung mga mabababang motor, mga stands. So, uh, dati nagpapagawa kami, eh, nagpaparesize kami ng mga shop. So, naisipan ko na mag-DIY. So, ako na lang mag-resize ng sarili ko suspension. So, doon ako nag-upisa na magtabas ng mga shop. So, experiment sa hanggang sa tagal-tagal na nakukuha ko yung mga tamang paggawa ng mga suspension. So, dati kasi boss, ah, nag-start ako. So, mga ginagawa kong mga ah, shock noon. So, pag tabas lang, tabas lang. So, hindi na functional. So, wala na langis. Mas so, putol, putol lang. Yun na. Yeah. Hanggang sa ano kalipas boss, yung mga umabot ng mga bago mag-COVID, so, yung tropa ko, nasira ng shock nagtagas. Yeah, so, uh, pinuntaan ako rito. So, pa Uh, pinatry sa akin boss na i-repair so since na nagbubukas din naman ako ng shop mm -hmm. yeah, so YSS yung una kong ginawa eh, YSS G-Series yeah, so sa so sarili ko na opportunity na to na baka magawa ko yeah, so nakikita ko na rin kasi yung mga ibang mga shop to na gumagawa na rin so sabi sa sarili ko kung nagagawa nila baka magawa ko rin Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Anong brands yeah. boss yung ano yung pwedeng gawin dito sa shop? Uh, any brands boss, uh, any shop naman kahit kadalasan mas, ano yung mga uh, kadalasan boss na ginagawa ko rito boss mga YSS, RCB, boss. Kahit anong shop ng boss pati mga steering damper, stabilizer, tsaka mga yan mga coilovers, mga uh, shop na sasakyan gagawa natin. Sing iba uh, worry nila or concern nila yung mga PSA. So pag dito dinala yung shop kayo na rin bahala sa PSA. Oo, oh, boss. Lahat boss sa akin na lahat. Oh. Eh, yung tono, sir, na ako siya. Yun, boss. Uh, yung gusto, boss, na tono rin nila, boss, makakagawa rin natin. Okay. Tsaka, hindi lang, ano, boss, mga repair, pati resize. Yan. Oh, yung exactly. mga size ng shocks, pwede natin uh, babae. Uh, functional pa. Pag resize, ibig sabihin yung haba? Ano ba, boss, yung shock is the 305. So, gusto nila pagbaba, magagawa natin sila, boss, hanggang 275. Kahit anong size na gusto nila, boss, magagawa natin. Uh, Sunod nung ginawa natin na yun, no? uh, yung nitro na ito, naka-happy. Okay pala, no? kasi nakaka-relate si Boss sa stance eh. <laughs> uh, ito si Boss brand new. So, walang mabiling size na ganito na 275. So, 335 yung standard size na nabibili, tsaka 305. Pang end box to, huwag end box. Walang mabiling 3, uh, 275 na size, so 335 talaga yung mabibili. So, no choice sila, boss. Kundi magpatabas. Sa stance yan, ha? Magpatabas talaga di, boss, pang uh, tie concept. Mga boss, sa mga, mga nasisiraan ng suspension, yan mga boss, mas maganda rin na huwag nyo nang patagalin boss. Kasi kag, pagka nag-leak to boss, kung nag yung suspension, so pinatagal, hindi mo pinagawa. So ang mangyayari boss, natadamay pa dito. So lalaki yung gasos mo, yung pinaka-shopping yung sa gitna. Nasisira, nagkakagas-gas, so another time na naman. So mas maganda boss, pagka nagtagas talaga. Uh, minor pa lang, pagawa na, para hindi lalaki yung gasos. May usual ba na maintenance yun? Ah, uh, eh, siya. Wala boss kasi kung para sa akin boss, wag, uh, kung di lang siya mag-leak kasi hindi naman dumain nyo lang yun eh, nasa loob naman. Hindi naman dumain nyo lang yun. Kung nga, pag uh, nag-leak, 
Punta ka po sa lang Rick, hindi natin alam kung kailan. Oo, oh, oh, kasi depende sa gamit mo. Oh, boss. Pero mas maganda, boss, kung kahit kulang lip, boss, mas maganda eh. Kung nakarami ka ng tangin sa motor, ba, eh, naka 30,000, o oh, mas maganda, si pare-press yung chaser, para yung play, boss, hindi na dumato. Tapos dito napansin namin, ano eh, medyo maselan din yung gawa eh. Kasi dating nagmumotor din. Oh. Nagmumotor din si sir eh. Kaya, tapos stands pa. Kaya, oh, boss. Una din yung ano, uh, concern din nga yung format eh. Kaya, mag-iingat din sa mga oh, boss, gamit. Na, tools. Kaya boss, kinumpleto din natin yung mga oh. tools. O, oh, hindi kasi pwedeng pukpo ko lang na pukpo eh. <laughs> may tools, may tagawa. Oh, boss, dapat siya, yung pwede, dapat yung tools para safe, safe din yung gagawin natin. Thank you, Sir Greg. Kaya po, sa mga gusto magpagawa. Yeah. Uh, Dreadsworks, uh, talapayong right pampanga, yan. Uh, Waze nyo lang or uh, Google Map Dreads for some panga. Alright. So with the front inverted shocks and the single YSS rear shock for repair, need namin to E1 and balikan within the next few days. Actually, the following day, tapos na ni Sir Greg. We just had other schedules kaya we needed to schedule the pickup. The day came when we finally got the Zoomer back with its newly restored suspension. Sir Gred replaced the front suspension springs and refilled the suspension oils just with the right specs for the comfy ride Wiki was looking for. Now, the Zoomer rides comfortably with the upgraded front suspensions and the restored YSS shock on the rear. Thank you so much to Gred's Works Pampanga and Sir Gred for the comfortable ride ng Zoomer now. So time to hit the road again and enjoy the ride. Happy weekend everyone. Until the next one. Take my heart and keep